people can come to our show, see the work, and get launched off in a direction that has them um, interacting with the city of Milwaukee in whatever way works for them, but that does so through one of these channels that we've discovered um, through our interaction, I think then that's building community. That's, that's like a, a tangible form of community building. So then we get to participate in the city of Milwaukee as opposed to just observe it. And that's, I think, a regular goal for us. Right. Yeah, no, I think that's really interesting that you say, like, because we have been observing Milwaukee, you know, from afar, from personally. Um, so I think the, another goal is to, yeah, bring people together, um, have them share their ideas, because we're not the only people that are interested in talking about this city. Um, and I think this is just a very different, like, platform for people to be able to do that outside of, um, you know, maybe going to City Hall or, or doing a march or, you know, something else, something different where um, there's that freedom to just have a conversation and see where it goes, see how it develops, how it can maybe affect change, right? Yeah, and, and also, we, I know we talk a lot about um, making work that doesn't just reflect the city of Milwaukee, but um, it's very, there's so many things going on at this time, at this place, that are um, difficult and complex. And so we talk a lot about making work that um, builds this, this positive vision for the future of the city of Milwaukee. Um, so sometimes we try to like infer how these people can affect the city. And so... Um, Showing like the potential of what what they could do or what what we could do. And we're artists, so they're rather weird. <laughs> you know, that's it's a weirder way of thinking about the future as opposed to a fully logical way. And so um, that's I think healthy to have audience members bend their brain a little bit and think about the city in creative new ways. Yeah.